cannot express their chagrin, their outrage, their disappointment, their distress, and their abandonment at this critical moment. In my faith tradition, as in many of yours, we're called to look out the most for those who cannot look out for themselves. Jesus framed them as the least of these, my brothers and sisters. I can't improve on that, I dare say none of us can. The state of North Carolina needs to improve its looking out for the least of these. For that is what the state is charged to do, entrusted to do, not later, but now. The theory of community-based care that first found expression during the Nixon administration simply has not found its legs, not found its resources, not found leadership with the will to give it shape in our many localities, much less find the money to fund it adequately. Volunteers and private contractors have simply not developed the program, the infrastructure, to trade off what they do for what Dorothea Dix Hospital has done since the middle of the 19th century. To vacate our only public mental health facility in the midst of a county of nearly a million citizens, to do so at this particular moment without an alternative in place, without an effective alternative already in place, is simply unconscionable. It is as if mercy is being denied to the least of these. May God have mercy on us all.